Christmas, Pat. Merry Christmas, Mrs. Goggins. My word, what a lot of post. Well, it is Christmas Eve. I know. And it's the Christmas show tonight. Mira's playing Cinderella. And Julian's Prince Charming. Meow. And Jess is Cinderella's cat. I want to get to Pankaster and back before the snow gets too thick. I have to collect the Greendale Christmas tree. Oh, how lovely. The tree really makes it feel like Christmas, na? Aye. I better get a move on. <gasps> Bye, love. Take care, Ajay. <laughs> hmm. Merry Christmas, everyone. Merry Hello, Christmas, Pat. Pat. We're grooming Pumpkin. He's going to be pulling Cinderella's golden coach. Well, you two are doing a smashing job. He looks grand. Whoa! <laughs> Mr Pringle, I think I should be right at the front of the stage at all Whoa. times. Cinderella is the star after all. Uh, yes, Mira. I see. Hello, Jeff. Here's your post. What's going on? We're having a last rehearsal before the show this afternoon. Oh, uh, we would be if everyone weren't <laughs> being so silly. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> I think I'd better leave you to it, Jeff. This snow is getting very thick. Come on, girl, no time to waste. Everybody in Greendale is waiting for that tree. This beauty that enters. Ugly sister coming through. Oh, now look what Jess has done. Oh, dear. Is that Cinderella's sleigh? It looks smashing, Ted. It's all ready to take down to the school. Grand, I'm off to the station. I promised Ajay I'd help him with the Christmas tree. See you later, Ted. Bye, Pat. We'll soon be home, girl. I hope. What do you think? What do you think? Not bad, eh? No, Charlie, it's awful. <sighs> You've completely ruined it. What's wrong with her? Dunno. Righty o. Let's give you a drink. Oh no! There's hardly any water left. It must have frozen up. I have come to find the owner of this... Of this glass slipper. Uh, uh, of this, uh... Glass slipper! Oh, Julian, you should know your words by now. Sorry, Mira. Mira shouldn't be telling Julian his words. That's my job. Oh, dear. <laughs> I hope that's enough to get us home, or Greendale won't have its tree in time for Christmas. Hello, Nisha. Is Ajay back yet? No, he's not. Maybe he's stuck in the snow. Don't worry, Nisha. I'll go and look for him. He can't be far. Oh, thank you, Pat. The line's blocked. Now, where did I put that shovel? It's not here. I must have forgotten it. What am I going to do now? Whoever's shoe fits this foot shall... No, Julian. It's whoever's foot fits this shoe. 
Dad! Dad! Just a minute, Charlie. Oh! Oh, Sarah! I couldn't help it. Oh, no one's taking it seriously. We'll never put on a good show now. <laughs> Oh, dear. <sighs> oh, no. I can't make it through this snow. What do I do now? I know. Come on, Mira. It's not that bad, surely. Oh, Amy. I wanted everything to be just right for the show, but it's all gone wrong. Amy! Amy! Sorry to interrupt, but can I borrow Pumpkin for a couple of hours? Pumpkin? But, Pat, you can't take Pumpkin. Cinderella can't get to the ball without him. I'm sorry, Mira. I wouldn't take Pumpkin if it wasn't important. But we think your dad and the rocket might be stuck in the snow, and I need Pumpkin to go and find them. I'll get Pumpkin right now, Pat. <sighs> Will Dad be all right? He'll be fine. Don't worry. Here he is, Pat. Thanks, Amy. You'd better get mm. back, Mira. You and your friends have a show to put on. It's not going very well. Oh? I wanted the show to be a big success, and nobody seemed to care, and I shouted. And now, I think I've upset everyone. Never mind. Maybe now's the time to go back and start again. Yes. OK, Pat. I'll do my best. Good girl. And don't worry, <laughs> we'll be back before you know it. Here we are. One golden coach fit to carry a princess. Hmm. Maybe not a princess, Ted. More like a postman. Eh? It's no good. This could take hours. And if I can't get home tonight, that means no tree, no proper Christmas for Greendale. <laughs> It'll be no laughing matter if we don't find Ajay and get you back before the show starts. That's it, Pumpkin. Steady now. Well, what do you think? Oh. Oh, dear. Here, Sarah. Let me help. Thanks, Vera. <laughs> and you and I, Cinderella, will live happily ever after. That sounds great, Julian. Uh, thanks, Mira. Everyone, let's give them a show they'll never forget. Yeah! yeah! Of course! <laughs> that sounds like. <laughs> Pumpkin! Ajay! I'm fat! Am I glad to see you? I thought I was going to be here all night. Let's get you home before the snow starts again. But I can't leave the rocket back. Don't worry. Alf will clear a path for her with his snowplow in the morning. OK, Pat. Come on, then. Let's get that tree back to Greendale. I wonder where Pat and Pumpkin are. It's almost time for the magic coach. Don't worry, sir. Leave it to me. Behold, Cinderella. Here is your magic coach 
that will carry you to the ball. <laughs> Thanks, Bill. No problem, Ada. I mean, cinders. Come, cat, Meow. to the prince's palace. Meow. Well done, Pumpkin! Oh, come on, we might still be in time for the show. It fits! Cinderella, you shall be my bride! Oh, that was oh, lovely! Wonderful. <laughs> Oh, Julian, I'm sorry I missed the show. And I'm sorry I didn't make it in time with Pumpkin, Mira. Never mind, Pat. Is Dad all right? Uh, he was right behind me. Hello! <gasps> Dad! A day! Sorry I missed your play, love. That's OK. It's just good to have you back, Dad. I've got a special surprise for you and everyone. Come on outside. Meow. I just want to say thank you to Pat, who saved me from the snow and saved Greendale's Christmas. <gasps> oh, Dad! You and Pat even put presents under the tree. What? But I didn't bring any presents. Did you, Pat? No, but I think I know who did. Oh, thank you, Santa! Thank you, Santa. Thank you, Santa! You know, Jess, it really is going to be a wonderful white Christmas after all. <laughs> Merry Christmas, everyone. Merry Christmas! <laughs> What do you think of my beard, Jess? Meow. Wait till you see the whole outfit. I'm dressing up as Santa Claus for the party tonight. Can't wait to see everyone's face when I... I mean, when Santa walks in. Meow. Dear Santa, I hope you can make it to Greendale for Christmas. What I'd really like for Christmas is, uh, my very own aeroplane. No, I've already got one. What do I want for Christmas? Hmm, now what do I need? Eggs? Yes. Flour? Yes. Mum? I can't think what to put in my letter to Santa. And it's Christmas Eve. Oh, don't worry. I'm sure you'll think of something, Julian. Good morning. Ooh, what are you making? I thought I'd make a Christmas cake for the party tonight. Mmm. I wonder if Santa likes Christmas cake. Maybe we should leave a piece for him just in case. Oh, yes! I'd better get on. Mm. I've got lots of extra Christmas parcels and cards to deliver today. Oh, well, at least it's not snowing. Snow! That's it. Hey. Dear Santa, I hope you can make it to Greendale for Christmas. And what I'd really like for Christmas is snow! Oh, do you think Santa will get this in time? I'll make sure of it. I promise. Thanks, Dad. 
Hello, Charlie. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Are you looking forward to the party later? Yes, and, and, and there's going to be a special guest and everything. Who is it? I don't know. It's a secret. Who is it, Dad? What makes you think I know who it is? Because you know everything, Dad. You'll find out soon enough. Come on, Charlie. He's not going to tell us. Let's go play. Hmm. I'm sure I had flour. Where's it gone? Well, it can't have gone far. I'll help you look for it. Oh, I wish it would snow. Then Christmas would be perfect. Hmm. Is this snow? What are you talking about? Look! Come on! Let's investigate! Snow? No, it's flower. Yes. Oh, dear. I can't find the flower anywhere. I'll have to get some more. It's a mystery. Hmm. Just like you're a secret party guest. Come on, Pat, give me a clue. Nope. <laughs> I don't know who's worse, you or Julian. <laughs> oh, no, I should be at the post office by now. Mrs Goggins will be wondering where I've got to. You will be able to make it to the party later, won't you? I wouldn't miss it for the world, Sarah. Cheerio. Bye-bye, Pat. <gasps> well, looks like it is snowing after all. Oh, well, I'd better be prepared. <laughs> Great idea, Charlie. Who needs real snow anyway? Strange. The snow stopped. Oh, it's all gone. That flower must be in here somewhere. <coughs> Is that you, Julian? <sighs> Have you seen a bag of flour anywhere? Uh-oh. Let's go sledging. Julian? Oh. <sighs> Oh, yes! So that's where all the flowers gone. <laughs> oh, 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 dear. Mrs Goggins! I'm here. Merry Christmas, Pat. And to you too, Mrs Goggins. Looks like we've got a busy day ahead of us. Yes, we've certainly got our work cut out delivering this lot in time for Christmas. Oh, and don't forget about the party. I've heard there's a very special guest coming along. Yes, so I hear. One, two, three, push! Oh. Uh, oh. It's no use, Charlie. This is hopeless. Hello, Bill. What are you two looking so miserable about? Oh, it's the sledge. It won't budge without snow. You don't need snow. Don't we? No. I'll get it going for you. Come with me. Perfect. All I need now is the mixing bowl. <laughs> oh! What's going on? Yes! Should have known. Morning, Pat. Merry Christmas. Hello, Ajay. Special delivery for you. Grand. I've been waiting for that. Ooh, you've been busy. Well, with the special guests coming to the Christmas party, thought I'd better make a good impression. They might come by train. <clears throat> uh, maybe. <clears throat> What's in the parcel, then? I'll show you. Hello, Pat. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Nisha. And you, Nick. 
You're just in time to try one of my sweet mince pies. Oh, they smell grand, Nisha. Oh, I hope they're okay. I made them for the party tonight for the special guest. Thank you. Oh, I hope the guest has a good appetite. Oh, maybe I should make a few more, just in case. Bye, Pat. Cheerio, Nisha. Could you give me a hand with this, Pat? What on earth are you going to do with that? Well, I can't let the Greendale rocket miss out on all the festivities, now can I? Ah. Perfect. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> nice and sticky. Meow. 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 How did you get the sledge to go without any snow? Easy. I put my old skateboard wheels underneath. Look. Hey. Can we have a go? Jess, <coughs> Jess, come here. No, no, Jess, don't go under the table. Come here. <coughs> oh, you are naughty. Come here. Come here this minute. It's only a wooden spoon. What's all the fuss about? This doesn't look right at all. Uh-oh. I nearly gave the game away. Hello there. Are you lost? Um, yes, I think I might be. I'm trying to get to Greendale. I've got some business to attend to there. Um, I could give you a lift if you like. As long as you don't mind coming on my rounds with me. That's very kind of you. It'll be nice to see how it's usually done. That was great. But I know something we definitely can't do without snow. What's that? We can't make snowmen. No, but I know something we can make. What? You'll see. So, do you know Greendale well, then? No, not really. I only get out here once a year and it's usually snowy. I much prefer it when there's snow. My vehicle runs much better. <laughs> you sound just like my son. He's even written to Santa asking for snow for Christmas. Well, stranger things have happened. Will this do? It's perfect. Look! Sorry. You're right. We didn't need snow after all. This is the best no snowman ever. I'll just get the oven nice and warm. <coughs> oh! Oh! A bit to the left, Ted. No, no. A bit more. That's perfect. Our special guest will be impressed. Aren't you going to tell me who it is, then? Only Pat knows. And he's keeping it a secret. Hey, up. Who's this? Mmm. You'll be wanting the letters for Jeff Pringle and Ted Glenn, right? I didn't know you knew Jeff and Ted. Oh, yes. I've known them since they were little boys. Well, I never. Hello, Pat. Got a helper today, then, have you? Yes, I need all the help I can get, Ted. I've got so many parcels and letters, I hardly know what to do with them. There you go. Thanks, Pat. And you, Jeff. Why, thanks, Pat. So, who's the mystery guest, then? <laughs> it wouldn't be a mystery if I told you, would it? Um, must be off, then. Cheerio. That party Jeff mentioned... Is it at the school hall? That's right. 
I'm sure you'd be welcome to come along. That's very kind of you. I'll see what I can do. Are you going, Pat? Yes, I have to be there. I've got a very special surprise for everyone. I just hope I make it in time. <laughs> We'd better get on with these deliveries then, hadn't we? Exhausted. I hope this cake is worth it. Oh, well, sounds like you think so, Jess. I don't think I could have managed without you today. Nonsense. Thanks to you, there'll be lots of smiling faces tonight. <laughs> so you'll be able to keep your appointment then? Yes, but what about you? Will you be able to get to your party in time? I hope so. I don't want to disappoint everyone. Look out! Oh, oh dear! Oh, oh dear. Um, are you OK? <laughs> don't worry about me, Pat. I'm used to a lot worse than that. <laughs> I'm not the best driver. <laughs> Once we even slid clean off a roof. <laughs> off a roof? Why don't we see if we can get it moving? Oh, it looks like we're stuck fast. Not for long. I've got just the thing. Oops. I should have brought my wellies, too. Here, try these for size. I always carry a spare pair just in case. <laughs> They're a perfect fit. Thank you. I wonder who the special guest at the Christmas party is. <gasps> Maybe it's a fairy. No, don't be silly. What about a pop star? Gosh! Do you think they'll give me their autograph? We don't even know who it is yet. Maybe it's a scientist. A what? Oh! Oh, 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 oof. It was only a suggestion. Well, whoever it is, I can't wait. I'm going home to get ready. See you at the party. Bye! See you, See you later. later. Bye! Bye. Bye. You'd think you'd been doing my job for years. <laughs> oh, uh, just stop here, please. But we're in the middle of nowhere. Are you sure this is right? Quite sure, Pat. <laughs> Thanks for the lift. No problem. Thank you. Oh, it was nothing. It's all in a day's work for me. What line of work is that exactly? 
Oh, he's gone. Oops, I forgot to give him his boots back. Oh, dear. It's starting to get dark. I'm running out of time. Oh, don't worry, Julian. He'll be there. Oh, dear. I'm going to be late. I won't even have time to change. So when's the special guest arriving, then? <laughs> Meets me. No one seems to know anything about it. And I've got the train gleaming. But I haven't had any passengers. Well, I haven't seen anyone. And I've been out decorating the tree all day. Oh, dear. The children will be disappointed. Well, what am I going to do with all those mince pies? Oh, don't worry. I'm sure they'll get eaten. Oh, oh. I haven't missed the special guest, have I? No, don't worry. We're still waiting. But where's Pat? I thought he'd be with you. Oh, no, sorry, dear. I haven't seen him since he went off on his rounds this morning. Oh. <gasps> ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas, everyone. Santa! Well, I never. No wonder he didn't come by train. Indeed. Who needs steam when you've got reindeer power, eh? Who wants a present? Me, please, oh, Santa. Yes, me, please. Me, please. Me, please. Mum, Mum, look. Where's Dad? I need to tell him all about it. Don't worry, Julian. I'm sure he'll be here soon. Oh. Now, young man, what would you like for Christmas? <laughs> a toy train, eh? <laughs> How did he know what he said? Because it's Santa! Ah! Oh. Well, children, I'm afraid it's time for me to go. Aww. <laughs> you see, I've got a very busy night ahead of me, because you know what day it is tomorrow, don't you? It's Christmas Day! That's right. So, good night, everyone. Bye, <laughs> Santa! Santa. Santa. See you next year! Yeah. Wait, Santa! You haven't met my dad! <sighs> oh, thank goodness I've made it. You're too late, Dad. Oh, dear. I'm sorry, Julian. Is everyone disappointed that the special guest didn't arrive? But he did! It was Santa, and you missed him! <laughs> Nice one, Pat. You had us all going there. Oh, oh yes, Pat. Well done. You made a wonderful Santa Claus. But, but, I, but I, I don't know. But if Dad was pretending to be Santa, where's the real one? Oh, Santa's very busy on Christmas Eve, Julian. That's why he has helpers like Daddy. Oh, I see. What, you mean Santa was here? Oh, you are a joker, Pat. <laughs> but what a lovely evening we've had. Look at all the smiling faces. Uh, 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 uh... Julian, Merry Christmas. 
Merry Christmas, Santa. What was that noise? Santa? <laughs> Hello, Julian. Dad! Mum! It's Santa! Yes, it's me. I've got presents for all of you. I hope you like the boots, Pat. Sarah, the cake is delicious. Thank you. It really is you! Of course. And I've left an extra present for you outside, Julian. You have? Just what I wanted! Snow! Christmas, everyone! Merry Christmas! Look! Goodness me, Jess. Look at that snow. We're going to have our work cut out for us today. Breakfast! <coughs> Oh, Ralph, look at that snowfall. Do you think you can clear it? Hey, aye, no problem. Nothing's too much for my snow plough. <laughs> By heck. Julian, eat up your breakfast. You don't want to be late for school. Yes, Mum. Hello. Oh, good morning, Jeff. Yes. Oh, right. Uh-huh. OK, then. I'll let him know. Yes. Bye now. Well, looks like you're having a snow day. A what? School's closed because of the snow, so you've got an extra day's holiday. Hooray! Can I try on my new super sledge? OK, but finish your breakfast first. Goodness me. That was a close one. Sorry, Pat. Be all right? Yes, no harm done. Oops, sorry, Jess. See you later, Pat. Bye, Alf. Come on, Jess. Don't want to be late for work. Have a good day, son. Be careful when you're sledging. Thanks, Dad. See you. Morning, Pat. Morning, Jess. Good morning, Mrs Goggins. What a day. I have never seen the snow so deep. Mm. Ah, well, here's the post all sorted. Oh, and I almost forgot. Oh! It's Alf's new ladder. Right. Will you be able to fit it into the van? Hmm, maybe I can strap it onto the roof. Cheerio, Mrs Goggins. Bye, Pat. Hi, Charlie. Hello, Mr Pringle. Oh, me back. Hello, Julian. Do you want to come sledging, Charlie? Oh, oh yes. Can I, Dad? Why, I course you can, son. But mind, be careful of the frozen pond there. That ice is not safe, you know. Don't worry, Dad. We will. Bye, Mr Pringle. Bye, lads. Morning, Pat. Hot chocolate? Thanks, Nisha. That'd be lovely. Hello, 
but... Morning, Ajay. Here's your post. Thanks. Hello there, love. Have you got the bulbs? Aye. It's not really the weather for planting, is it? <laughs> not flower bulbs. Bulbs for the lamppost. One of them popped last week. We've been waiting for the new ones to arrive. Bit of a problem, though. I can't reach it. Hang on a minute. I might be able to help you there. Are you all right, Pat? Yes. Will this do? Hi. That's champion. There you go. Perfect. Thanks, Pat. Don't thank me. Thank Alf. It's his new ladder. Oh, uh, will he mind us borrowing it? I shouldn't think so. But I'd best get on and deliver it. See you later. Thanks for the hot chocolate. Bye, Bye Pat. Bye, Pat. I used to love sledging when I was a lad, Jess. I'd love to have a go now. I wonder if... Hi, Dad. Hello, Pat. Hello. Hello. Hello, Pat. Can I have a go? Of course. Do you want to try my new super sledge? <laughs> I'd love to. It's got special aerodynamics. So you have to be Thanks, careful. Thanks, Julian. But I'm a bit of a whiz on a sledge. You never forget. It's like riding a... Whoa! Oh, no! Ah! Help! Oh, oh no! Ow! That was brilliant, Pat. Can you do it again? No. I think that's enough sledging for one day. Ouch! <laughs> Maybe you should stick to delivering letters, Dad. Yes, I think you're right. I'd best be off. Bye, everyone. Don't forget to stay away from the ice now. We will, Pat. Bye, Pat. Bye, Dad. <laughs> Look out below! Oh, oh dear. Ooh. Hang on, Ted. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, it's no use. Real I'm just going back to the van a minute, Ted. Ooh. I'll have you out in a jiffy. Don't go anywhere. Ooh. I can't stand this much longer. Right. Here we go. <laughs> Bye, heck. Thanks, Pat. No problem, Ted. Thank goodness I had Alf's new ladder with me. Aye. You'd better get inside before you catch cold. You're right, Pat. Bye. Uh, 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 and the Olympic champion Bill Thompson begins his final and surely gold medal winning run. Yahoo! Come on, Katie. We can beat him. Yeah! Watch out! <gasps> Help! 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 Don't worry. It'll be OK. We've got a plan. Think of a plan. Um... Hold on. I'll go and get your mum. <laughs> That's Dad. Tom, Katie, my dad's here. He'll rescue you. Don't worry. Dad! Stop! What on earth? Stop! Julian, what's the matter? Tom and Katie, they're on the ice. Oh, no. Jess, you stay there. Meow. Mum! Mum! Help! Tom! Katie! Don't worry. What 
are we going to do? It's too deep to wade out to them. And too cold to swim. Gosh. I know. Tom, Katie, see if you can grab the branch. <laughs> it's no good. We can't do it. What are we going to do? Meow. Meow. The ladder. Why didn't I think of it before? Hold on, you two. I'll be back soon. Oh. Here we go. My gum. Everything all right, but... Alf, quickly. The twins are in trouble on the ice. By heck. Ah! Oh, it's OK. Pat's back. Don't worry, you two. We'll soon have you off that ice. Now, I reckon that if we lay the ladder across the ice like this... Aye. Uh -huh. And you act as an anchor at one end like this... Right. Then I should be able to crawl across it and reach the twins. Be careful, Pat. Tom, Katie, I'm coming to get you now. Mm. <sighs> now then. <sighs> Slowly. <sighs> All right. Now, Katie, you first. Just crawl back along the ladder. Come on, now. OK. Tom, I'll be back for you in a minute. Be brave. I will. That's it. Uh, Keep going. Just uh, look straight ahead. Uh, Mum! Oh, thank heavens. Hurry, Pad. Hurry! I'm coming, Tom. Keep calm. Oh. Now, Tom, do just what Katie did, and we'll be safe and sound in no time. I'm scared. You'll be fine. Trust me. Pat, help! Hurry, Tom. Keep going. My gum, Pat. That was close. Oh, thank you, Pat. I dread to think what would have happened if you hadn't been here. I'm glad I could help. Are you two OK? Thank you. Yes. Thank you, Pat. You're more than welcome. Thank goodness we had your ladder, eh, Alf? Eh? I, I, I'm right glad you had it with you, Pat. Come on, you two. It's a hot bath and a warm drink by the fire for you. Bye, Bye Pat. Pat. Everyone. Bye, you two. Bye, Bye Tom. Tom. Bye, Katie. Bye, Katie. Bye, Tom. Well, I think that's enough excitement for one day. Come on, Julian. You were great, Dad. Thank you, son. I'm glad Katie and Tom were all right. <laughs> yes, Jess. I'm tired, too. It's been a long day. Let's go home. Thanks, Mrs. Goggins. Oh, here is a funny one. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe it's a square lollipop. It's for Ted Glenn. Oh. Excuse me, Jess. <coughs> it's special delivery, so Ted's got to sign for it. Right you are. You be careful out there today, Pat. Snow's settling good and proper. <laughs> You're right there, Mrs. Goggins. Come on, Jess.
that's only snow. <laughs> oh, dear. Perhaps it is a bit deep for you. <laughs> Don't fall off. Oh, dear. He's not in. That means I'll have to come back. So good. Cheers, Dad. <laughs> I don't suppose any of you have seen Ted, have you? I need him to sign for a parcel. No, oh, I know where he is. Him. Sorry. Doesn't he help Ajay on the train today? Oh, perhaps you're right. My mum wants him to clear snow off our drive, but he says he hasn't got a snow shovel. Oh. Come on, let's go. Bye, Bye Pat. Bye, Pat. Bye, Pat. Bye, Pat. <laughs> <laughs> I'd love to have a go on a snowboard, Jess. Meow. Well, we didn't have snowboards when I was a lad. Meow. Coming, Jess. Meow. <laughs> oh, all right, Jess. You stay there. Meow. Oops. Hello, Pat. The snow's getting deep, isn't it? It is, Nisha. Morning, Reverend. Good morning, Pat. Uh, more tea, Vicar? Oh, bless you. Takes more than a bit of snow to stop the Greendale rocket getting through. <laughs> right, Ajay. Here you are. Is Ted around? I've got this parcel for him. No, not yet. Shall I hang on to it for him? Well, thanks, but it's a special delivery. He's got to sign for it. OK. Never mind. I'll catch him later. Bye, Ajay. Bye. One for you, Pat. Ah, lovely. Surrender. You win. Come on, Dad. Play snowballs. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I've got to get up to Thompson Ground for my next delivery. Bye. Bye, Bye. Pat. Bye. Bye. See you later. Bye. See you later. Bye. Bye. Let's make a snowman. Yeah. yeah. Whoa. Ooh, this is getting a bit bad, Jess. All aboard! All aboard! Oh. <coughs> oh. 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 Hey. Oh. It's hey. heavy! Oh. I am! <gasps> oh no! Bill, stop! Hey! This, 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 this too much momentum! You are hot. Momentum! It's, it's, it's velocity times mass! Eh? It's too big! We won't be able to stop it! 
Why didn't you say so? I did! Oh, it's going towards the railway. What if the train hits it? It's big enough to make it come off the rails. Oh, no! It'll be coming soon. We've got to stop the train. How do we do that? Um, um, wave. We always wave. We've got to phone the station. But it's miles to the nearest phone. No, there's one at my house, at Thompson Ground. It's not that far. That's where Dad said he was going. OK. Let's split up. You lot, come with me up to Thompson Ground and see if we can find Pat. And you lot, run along the bank and watch out for the train. Dad'll know what to do. If we can find him. Oh, no! Here it comes! Dad! We rolled the train! 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 The I can't hear if you all talk at once. It's we made a big train. snowball. We made a big snowball and it's rolled down the hill. And it went on the railway line. And the train will come off the rails if we don't stop it in time. It's on its way right now. Oh, we must stop it. Hmm. No, we'll never make it in time. My van's hopeless in this snow. I know. Whoop. Oh! Try it with this, Dad. It'll help you keep your balance. Oh, right. Don't worry, everyone. We'll stop the train. Ooh. Ah. Ooh. Ah. Oh. Dad could snowboard. Me neither. Oh no! Yeah! He's brilliant. Oh, it's coming! Oh no! Wave! Out hey. of hey. Stop it, Children do love steam trains. <laughs> Aye, they do that. Ajay! Hey, stop, stop. Ajay! Stop. What on earth? Ah. Whoa. Whoa. Watch out! Oh! Oh! Oh, no! It's back. Something's wrong. Oh, my! Phew. I say, what's happening? We did it! We did it! Ah! Oh, help! Oh. Thanks, Pat. That was close. Well done, Pat. You saved the train. Oh, no. It was the children, really. <sighs> It'll take hours to clear that. We've only got the coal shovel. How am I going to get my passengers to Pancaster? Ted! I've been looking for you. This is yours. It's my new snow shovel. You've got to sign for it. 
It's a special delivery. Oh. I ordered it last week so I could help Mrs. Pottage clear snow off her drive. That's just what we need, Dead. Right you are. <laughs> That's it. Thanks, Dead. Thanks, Pat. Thanks, everyone. You're most welcome. God bless us all. All aboard! All aboard! Full steam ahead! Well, I'd best go back and check Jess is all right. See you later, everyone. Goodbye. Uh, and mind you, stay away from the railway track in future. Yes, Dad. Oh. Got you. Oh, so you want to play, eh? OK, come on. Take that. Ow! Oh, got you. Yeah. Take that. OK, you want to Go on, then. <laughs> you and you, yeah, gotcha. Yes. <laughs> Morning, Mrs. Goggins. Chilly out there today. Uh, that's all I've got for you today, I'm afraid. You'll have to collect the rest of the post from the station. And Jay should be back from Pencaster with it by now. <laughs> Jay, is everything all right? No, it's not all right. The rocket's frozen solid, and I haven't been able to get to Pancaster to collect the post today. I'm just trying to unstick the water pipe to get her going again. Hmm, looks like it's come unstuck all right. Oh, no! The Greendale rocket will never move now. Look at the car park, too. Oh, dear. All that water has frozen solid. <laughs> How am I going to get rid of all this ice? I don't know, Ajay. But now I haven't got much post to deliver, I'll get back as soon as I can and give you a hand. Thanks, Pat. Oh, this... this is slippy. Ooh, steady. Whoa! Hey! That was close. Meow. Careful, Jess. Meow, meow, meow. Meow. Come on, Jess. We've got post to deliver. Mira? What are you doing here? Shouldn't you be at school? The heating isn't working. Mr Pringle sent us all home until he can get it fixed. Oh, dear, poor Jeff. Mum, can we play outside? OK, but be careful because it's very icy out there. Thanks, Mum. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, you two. No school today. No, the heating's broken. Would you like a ride on our sledge, Pat? <laughs> Not today, thanks. You two have fun, though. Thanks. Come on. There you go, Julia. Oh, thanks, Pat. What's that you're doing? Oh, well, it's a, it's a bit slippy out here, so I'm sprinkling some grit on the path. It melts the ice. What a good idea. That's just what Ajay needs for the frozen car park. Well, I've got plenty to spare, Pat. You're welcome to take this sack and give it a try. Thanks, Julia. That's very kind of you. Cheerio. Bye, Pat. Meow. Careful on the path. <laughs> <laughs> 
I haven't gritted all of it yet. Whoops. I see what you mean. Gangway! <laughs> Ta-da! Oh, wow! Did you see Pat go? Yes! <laughs> Come on, Jess. Meow. Oh. Meow. Meow. It's just like a real ice ring. And it's brilliant for sliding, too. Watch this. Woohoo! Jeez on bees! Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> it's fantastic. My turn! Woo! <laughs> Come on, Mira! No, I'm going to dance on the ice like a real ice skater. That's oh. boring. Come on, Bill. Let's see who can slide the best. <laughs> Nice try, Mira. Thank you. But what you need are some ice skates. I used to have a couple of old pairs lying around somewhere. Ooh, can I try them, Dad? Hi. Why not? I'm not having much luck fixing the train. Why don't we both have a go? I'll see if I can find them. Thanks, Dad. Are you coming, Jess? Watch out, sheep. I've got letters to deliver. Ouch! Oh, dear. This ice is making things very tricky. I hope Ajay's OK at the station. Maybe these ice skates weren't such a good idea after all. Oh, come on, Dad. It'll be fun. Ouch! Ouch! Oops! Sorry, Dad. Oh, it's OK. Go on. Give them a whirl. <laughs> well done, Mira. You're doing great. Just takes practice, that's all. I think I'll stick to diving trains. Oh. Watch out, Ajay! Hey. Hey. hey! Watch out, lads! <laughs> oh. Hello there, Ted. Whoa! What? Watch out! Ooh. Some post for you, Ted. By heck, but that were impressive. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, I'm having a right job delivering the post with all this snow and ice about. Oh, well, you see, that's where my latest invention comes in handy. It's the Ted Glenn automatic de-icing machine. It melts all that snow and ice in a jiffy. Watch. All you have to do is point it at what you want to de-ice. Like this. Wow, now that is impressive. Ajay could do with that to de-ice the Greendale rocket and the car park. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's go. <laughs> Yahoo! <laughs> Come on, you two. Don't you want to try skating? No. This is much more fun. <laughs> I'll go and see if I can find something to slide on to make it faster. Whoa! <laughs> oh, come on, Bill. All proper ice skaters have skating partners. Nah, skating's for girls. Why? Because boys can't do it. Can, sir. Go on, then. Show me. 
on the train to slide on. What are you doing? Uh, nothing. Come on, let's just try out those sacks. But I thought you were my skating partner. <sighs> hey, everybody. Come and get some nice hot chocolate. Hooray! Hooray! You're skating really well now, Mera. Bill, Julian, have you been skating too? No, we've been sliding. Oh, I see. Mum, Dad, will you come and watch me do my ice dance? As soon as you've finished your hot chocolate. I wonder where Ajay's got to. I don't know, but it doesn't look like he's had much luck with this. Look at those icicles. Wait till I'm done with my machine. Let's try it on the rocket first, and then we can get cracking on the car park. <coughs> wow, Pat! How did you get rid of all those icicles? With Ted's new de-icing machine. What do you think? It's wonderful. Thank you, Pat. I'll de-ice the car park now. No! no! Stop! 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 What's wrong? We don't want you to melt the ice in the car park. Why not? It's our ice rink. Ice rink? Aye. They've been playing on the ice all day. Mira's even been practising an ice dance on skates. Well, now you're talking. I love a bit of ice skating, me. I didn't know you could ice skate, Ted. Me? Oh, no, I've got two left feet. I just like to watch. Oh, I really need someone to skate with me to do my special ice dance. Can you skate, Pat? No, sorry, Mira. I Pat, you can. You might not have had skates on, but you were doing a grand job on that ice earlier. Why don't you give it a try? Oh, uh, no, I, I don't think it's a good idea. Oh, please, Pat. All the proper ice skaters have partners to skate with. Go on, Pat. You'll be great. <sighs> Boy, heck, Jess. Them's the best ice dancers I've ever seen. Thanks, Pat. You're a great ice dancer. Thank you. Are you OK, Pat? Um, <laughs> yes, thanks. But maybe I'll leave the skating to the real ice dancers like you from now on. Meow.